Hey guys, welcome to Stocks and Crypto Plays. I'm outside, so there may be some background noise. I want to tell you some breaking news again on Litecoin, some more very bullish news on Litecoin. So we may see a very parabolic move to the upside very soon, okay? So what is it that I see? Um, Litecoin price spikes after CFT, CFTC calls it commodity alongside Bitcoin and Ethereum. Okay, that's from late yesterday. Um, and it goes on to say meme coin lovers may be having a great month, but Litecoin holders are celebrating with their coin taking the spot as the second best performing crypto in the top 100 with a bullish performance in the last 24 hours that saw its price spike 11%. This comes on the fifth day of relatively slow markets with Bitcoin and ETH correcting less than 2% in the same period. Cryptocurrency globally sits at 2.79 trillion. Okay, that's basically flat in the last 24 hours. The most significant non-tech event contributing to Litecoin spike um, is a recent statement by the United States Commodity Futures Trading Commission, CFTC. In a lawsuit against the crypto exchange KuCoin, I'm not sure if you guys heard about that yet, but KuCoin was being so sued as well. The CFTC declared Litecoin a commodity. This statement is crucial as it places Litecoin outside the scope of the Securities and Exchange Commission, SEC, which regulates securities and imposes stricter responsibilities on coin issuers. This is absolutely massive. How many coins have been called um, a commodity? Not many. Not many. Uh, Bitcoin and Litecoin, okay? Um, and ETH, I guess. So what are these, like the big three now? Um, it was Bitcoin. Excuse me, there's a bee attacking me. It was Bitcoin. And, uh, sorry guys, this is like a live video and it's like a wasp trying to sting me. Um, but it makes for a more fun video, right? Anyways. It was just Bitcoin and Ethereum. Now Litecoin is considered a commodity, all right? This is great news. So KuCoin solicited and accepted orders, accepted property to margin. Okay, it's going on about KuCoin, but let's keep going. Being declared a commodity potentially opens the door for more comfortable endorsements and further integrations for Litecoin with less fear of the SEC attempting Enforcement actions. Litecoin started the day at $94 and traded sideways until 6 o'clock when bulls took over the market, spiked the coin to 106 before correcting to 105. Okay, let's see what else. On the tech side, Litecoin was trading sideways in January and February, bouncing horizontal channel between 63 and 67. Coin broke its channel on February 29, started bullish trend on March 1st. Most of the positive performance registered in 2024 has been due to March positive results. Since the bottom of the channel today high, there's been roughly 63% spike from the bottom of the channel. Wow. Past data shows that many of the usual large candlesticks are followed by a correction. Many small body candles in the last days, Litecoin failed to break past the resistance set by March 11 spike. Could point to a possible cup and handle, big spike followed by a symmetrical period of correction, recovery that cancels all losses, and a semicircle shape. If this is the case, there should be a smaller correction followed by a similar recovery before a bullish breakout. Overall, the coin looks bullish and healthy in a longer time frame. The relative strength index, it's called the RSI, shows that the coin is slightly overbought with 66% dominance of bulls over bears, with Litecoin proving its bullishness after bouncing from its exponential moving average EMA 55 and going back again to trade on top of EMA 10. Given that the coin is bullish in charts set at 24 hour candlestick, weekly candlesticks for the first time since June, 2023, immediate resistance could be around 115 for a 10% gain. If it remains strongly bullish, the next appears to be 135 for a nearly 29% gain. However, if it fails to meet expectation, corrects down, it could drop somewhere near 80 for a 22% loss. So we'll watch it close, but I think we're gonna move to the upside guys. All right, that's it. Hit like, subscribe, and notification. Share the video with a friend. Comment below. What do you think about it all? Talk to you soon. Have a great day.